Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer, and this is uh, Triquad Explosion. It's a variation to my Hexplosion puzzle. Um, when uh, George Miller visited me, um, he really didn't like the Hexplosion because it was awkward uh, to play. So I thought I made uh, this variation, which may be uh, equally awkward, but it was just uh, yeah, uh, fun to uh, uh, quickly 3D print puzzle. So Triquad Explosion, as the name already says, is an exploding puzzle and uh, it's very easy to take apart. You just start rotating pieces and you see everything rotates together until it explodes into pieces. And the object of the puzzle is uh, obviously to put it uh, back uh, together again. Um, we can uh, do the uh, original uh, uh, pattern with uh, triangles and squares, but uh, obviously you can uh, make uh, other patterns, uh, for instance, with, uh, with squares connected to each other or uh, triangles uh, connected to each other. Uh, let me... Yeah. You need to explode things and then uh, you can build all kinds of uh, patterns with these uh, uh, parts and uh, the way you make the final assembly is of course through this uh, type of rotation explosion. And the way that uh, uh, the puzzle uh, works is that uh, we have these dovetail connections, uh, upside down ones, and for the squares we always have up and down and up and down, so uh, they are alternating up and down, and for the triangles uh, it's down, down, up, down, down, up, or if you turn it upside down it's up, up, down, up, up, down. So the question that I have to you about uh, this puzzle is you can make all kinds uh, of uh, patterns with squares and uh, triangles, but here we have a limited set. And if you have um, lots of them or uh, uh, infinitely many of them, uh, any pattern that you can make with squares and triangles, can you also make it with this set, uh, this type of uh, pieces? Thank you for watching.